All right, well, today we've got a special uh, treat. Uh, I'm here with Weston Spencer from Salt City Steel. Um, he is a high level welder, uh, he's got experience in all kinds of stuff. And uh, today we're going to play with some cast aluminum. This is not an uncommon application where someone ran into a light pole that's made out of cast aluminum, busted the thing off, uh, and uh, needs to fix it. The problem is, the easy way to fix this would be just to go buy a new one. But believe it or not, just this light pole costs 4,900 bucks. We're going to use some Neptune MIG on it. Uh, we'll probably use two or three pounds. Uh, Weston's uh, gonna get paid for his job. You know, this is, this is his work. But um, we're gonna fix this for under a thousand bucks, probably closer to 700. Uh, and it will be better than it was before, I promise you, because we're gonna be using the very best aluminum materials possible, and we got the best welder in town. So, uh, let's get to it. All right, first, before we weld this up, you know, we gotta do some prep work here. So we'll come in here, we'll get rid of the, a lot of this powder coating paint. We're gonna come in with the rock mount bracers. We're gonna clean it up, get it really smooth, make sure we got a nice fit again. So we have some places where it's not wanting to go back on. It's a little bent, it's a little cracked. So we gotta clean up a little bit of blacking, a little bit of this cracks where it's all bubbly, you get nice smooth aluminum. And the cool thing is we don't have to get it exactly perfect as you would with a normal wire using the rock mount product. It's made for maintenance welding, so we can get in there and leave a little bit and still get a very good finished product out of this. So we're gonna clean this up, get it fitted, tack it on, and then we'll burn it all up. So for the prep work on this light pole base, we used the rock mount, the aluminum grinding discs, and we've done two of them. We did about 20 minutes each on each of these discs, all aluminum, getting the paint off, doing a lot of the prep work, smoothing everything out, and we've hardly got any buildup on these aluminum discs, and barely anywhere if they're gonna last. Okay, we got our light pole base, ground, prepped, tacked on here. We put some preheat on it, and now we're gonna go ahead and weld it with the Rock Mount Neptune 047 wire for the MIG here, and it should turn out really good. It's not bad, it's just, this stuff's like running a glue gun. It just goes right where you want it. Oh, that's I don't cool. mind it at all. Ooh, let's get that spot there. Might need a grinder. Yeah, I'm gonna grind this out of this. Wire. Let me fill that big hole in, no problem. Neptune is welded in very nicely. We're getting good, real strong penetration here. I'm very happy with it. So the crack was right here on top of this rib and we really welded it in quite well there. Fast and smooth and lots of heat and lots of wire. It's a trick with this rock mount Neptune aluminum wire. I'm really happy with how I can go do a second pass over it and really clean up any spots where the paint didn't let me weld. I had some impurities in there. It's turning out quite well. Not too sooty. Most of the soot you're seeing is coming from the black paint getting burnt. You know, we could have made it take a little more off, but with the rock mount Neptune, you really don't seem to have to. You can leave a little paint and it'll clean itself out. Very happy with it. I think we saved this customer quite a bit of money not having to replace this light bulb. 
All right, yeah, this rock mount Neptune, it really turned out amazing, better than I thought it would. We have all this hard powder coat on here. We could have maybe sandblasted some of this to get a little better, but without sandblasting, we turned out amazing. This, we got about two to three passes on some of this. This is not going anywhere. I'm very happy with how this welded. Some of these are amazing welds, some of these are not, but that is not the wire's fault. <laughs> we did really good here. I'm happy with this stuff. Okay, well, we, we got a beautiful weld uh, on something that is challenging. This, this uh, base had to be fit up properly. Uh, you just don't do this without a lot of experience and talent. And uh, Weston Spencer from Salt City Steel, uh, he took a welding machine that he hadn't used before and some wire that was new to him and just made beautiful welds. Uh, and this thing is going to stay. There isn't any question about whether or not it's going to fall over later. So, uh, thank you yeah, again. Thank you, and thanks for having some great product. Yeah. We definitely recommend this. You guys check out Rock Mount's line. They have some amazing different products, wires, grinding discs, all their stuff. I'm happy with everything I've touched. You know, it makes a big difference if you have the right tool when you're working on anything. And welding wire, welding rod is not different. So, we hope you'll check us out, look us up, and uh, try some of our product. Thanks. Thank you.